Climate change is important to me because it's important to the, our survival as the human species. Um, at the rate it's coming, it's very fast. Um, already one of the islands in the Pacific, Tivula, has gone under and the people have been evacuated. And I wonder if we have to wait for action until the subways in New York get flooded with the ocean rising. But it's important because it's, it affects everybody. I'm doing two things. One is I'm thinking theologically in a new way. Uh, we used to believe that uh, human beings were the pinnacle of creation and that uh, the environment was there for, our, for us to pillage and take and it was to support us. Now we understand that that's not true. I'll never forget a, a native woman saying to me, you know, we used to think that, uh, that rocks were nothing but rocks are alive. So we need to adjust our theological premises and I think that's the major contribution of the Christian churches to this whole debate. The other thing I'm doing is thinking politically about what should be happening. Um, and now the Canadian government subsidizes mining companies abroad uh, and they have very, uh, very small environmental uh, requirements. So for example, uh, I met in a meeting a man from Congo who said to me, uh, you know, you have Canadian mining companies in my country, do Canadians not care about how they act when they come to my country? Climate change is important for people of faith because we're human beings, uh, because we believe that creation is part of, of God's plan, not just the human being. My understanding of the nature of the church is that we're salt in the big stew, and our function is to lend flavor to the larger society. We should always be part of the larger society. We should never attempt to believe that uh, what we do is gonna make changes all by itself because it's not. So we join in and as I say, I think one of our main contributions should be theological as well as political.